Hello and welcome dear students. Today I will explain you a complete history of pi. Our agenda for today is defining pi, discuss uses and discusses history. So starting from the definition of pi, first of all it is denoted by this symbol you can see on your screen. It is defined as the ratio of the circumference of a circle to its diameter. It is also refers to at Archimedes constant. It commonly expressed as 3.1415929 or 22 by 7. Although it is an irrational number, not rational but irrational number with an infinite number of digits. There is no limit of digits. According to Augustus de Morgan, this mysterious 3.141592 which comes in at every door and window and down every chimney calling itself the circumference to a unit of diameter basically it is refers to as a circumference to a unit of diameter now let's discuss its uses uses of pi basically it is used to calculate volume surface area as well as the circumference of three dimensional 3d shapes here are two important formulas here are two important formulas that use pi the first one is used to calculate the circumference and it is equals to pi multiplied by diameter and the other one is used to calculate the area of a square and it is equals to pi r square in this way we can calculate circumference and area of a square now let's talk about its ancient history did anyone discover pi historical records do not clearly reveal who first discovered it or tried to calculate its value what we do to now is that certain ancient civilizations the babylonians the egyptians the greeks and the chinese have tried to approximate pi through different ways one by one we will discuss all its ancient civilizations who worked on pi why pi? For centuries, ancient scholars and scientists have puzzled over this mysterious number. What is it? What are its uses? And how has it figured in history? There are some important points in the relevance of pi. Pi continues to puzzle and amaze people in modern society. Pi theology is the use of different techniques to memorize as many digits of pi. It is celebrated all over the world on March 14 and it is known as Pi Day. 14 March is known as Pi Day and Pi Theology is the technique. Let's take a look on the history of Pi starting from the Archimedes who is known as the father of integral calculus. First of all, he developed an accurate method of obtaining Pi by drawing a regular polygon inside a circle and another outside it. Then after Ashmida, Zhu Chengzhui further refined the value of pi. Zhu Chengzhui expressed pi accurately up to 8 decimal places. Sir Isaac Newton has a great role in calculating the value of pi. He used the binomial theorem and he was able to calculate its value up to 16 decimal places. Next, the Egyptians used a value for pi 3.16045 or 256 by 81 for pi. After that, Babylonians used the value for pi 3 and this was later changed to 3.125. By the advent of 21st century, computer was able to express the value of pi to all decimal places. So it's all about the basic information or basic knowledge related to the history of pi so thank you so much for watching this video